good evening and I'm back with an amazing session about five theories of multiverse. I mean, I think I told you that I'm going to take a session on uh, space. So, uh, see, you know that space is vast, right? So, about space, what I'm going to do is take it in a lot of smaller, smaller sections and then we will try to cover space, okay? Uh, so, yes. So, today's session is going to be about five theories of multiverse in five minutes, all right? So going forward, before I go forward, by the way, you all know what my name is, right? My name is Nabamita and I am the master teacher for science in Vedantu, all right? Going forward, uh, and yes, before I start the session, I need to tell you that in Vedantu, we are starting with, okay, which way should I go? Aha, this, this looks better, yeah. So in Vedantu, we're starting up with uh, a new master, uh, new micro courses by us, all the master teachers who have taught a lot of toppers and a lot of people are who have cracked, uh, you know, J.E. Need and all of this. And also we uh, do take care of uh, you as well, the young wonders. And so we're launching a lot of micro courses and you can avail this offer for uh, by using this code NBMIC and before my name and micro courses, hence MIC and you get uh, to you get to buy this offer, uh, buy this courses for 95% off. And such batao to the courses are for just 11 rupees also at times. So just go and check it out what the courses are about. And if you uh, want to buy them, go ahead and buy them. Okay. So now let's talk about the five theories about multiverse. So uh, do you think that we are the only planet which has life? Uh, see, I would say that it's it's a little sad. We don't want to be loners in the whole universe, right? So I guess uh, I have like certain theories and I also do believe that it's a multiverse. Uh, and it's just not me. There are also other scientists and other astrophysicists who think that there are possibilities of multi. There is a possibility of multiverse. Okay. It's not universe. So the first theory or the first, uh, how do I say it? Let, let's just go with theory. Okay. So the first theory that talks about multiverse is that infinite universe. So a lot of scientists or astronauts think that maybe, maybe we have no proper proof about it, but I'm just going to let you know about the theories that we have. Is that cool? So the first theory that uh, is uh, known as infinite universe and the infinite universe talks about universe being flat and probably it's just continuing and continuing and there is no end to it. Okay. So that is the first theory that we can come up with infinite universe. Next is actually bubble universe. It might also happen that our universe is like a bubble and there exist a lot of other universes which are also in bubbles. So it is quite possible, it is quite possible that what is happening in this bubble, the solar system, the Milky Way galaxy, we are in this bubble, right? So what is happening in this bubble is probably not exactly what is happening in the other bubble and all these bubbles might be not depending depending on each other they all go about by themselves okay they're all independent ki yaha pe koi khana paka raha hai waha pe koi kuch aur kar raha hai or maybe they are not even human beings okay so we don't know what's happening so that's probably the concept of bubble universe don't confuse yourself with bubble universe and parallel universe okay they, these both are different okay so bubbles can be they are not dependent on each other they are all independent okay next one is daughter universe so you know what is quantum mechanics right you know uh, you have heard about it i'm pretty sure that it's not introduced to you at this young age but yes so in quantum mechanics you have something known as subatomic particles all the matter is made up of atoms you know that no atoms have inside them subatomic particles like electrons protons neutrons and all of this so now the scientists came up with an idea that maybe we have a big universe and then there are daughter universe which exists. Okay. In that also the universe is going on and they are probably depending on each other. Okay. Again, this is also not parallel universe. It's daughter universe. Probably there's a big universe and then daughter universes which are kind of related to the mother universe. All right. Okay. Going forward, there is another universe which is probably 
mathematical universe. So in this case, the scientist thinks that it all depends on the probability. There might be certain other universes where, for example, let's say that uh, I have gotten into a college in uh, California. Okay. Now the probability, what are the probabilities? You know, when you toss a coin, what happens? What is the probability? Either it will be head or it will be tail. There are two probabilities. Now, what are the probabilities that I have actually gotten through the college in Canada or California? It might happen that I have already caught the flight. I have reached there. It might happen that I did not like it and have come back. It might happen that I have uh, liked that place and I have stayed there. Or it might happen that I have not gone to California, but to some other place. So there are a lot of probabilities, right? So this mathematical universe takes care of all the probabilities. That is, everybody might be in different, different probabilities or they are different. They are working in different areas or different uh, scenarios. All right. That is the concept of mathematical universe. And now, last but not the least is parallel universe. So in parallel universe, what do we think? We think that if I am here, there is somebody who is exactly like me working in some other universe. Okay. And did you, do you know that parallel universe concept is applied in a lot of places? Marvel movies. And then there are cartoons like Digi, uh, in the uh, animes, Digimon. Uh, Digimon also takes care of this parallel universe. And Marvel, you have seen, right? Uh, in Avengers that all the planets align at certain point and all of that. So these are the concepts which are, uh, you know, fantasized in uh, uh, about parallel universe. All right. Do you all get it? Now, before I end the session, I would like to tell you again about the micro courses that we are uh, starting in Vedantu. In Vedantu, we are starting up with micro courses, which are which, can, which are about different, different topics and different, different, uh, you know, subtopics as well. So whatever you like, you can buy it. The courses come for as low as 11 rupees and you can avail an offer only for 95%, not only, sorry, for 95% uh, off by using the code NBMIC. All right. So NB for my name and MIC for micro courses. So yeah, that's all for today. And if you like what I have just told you, please like, share and subscribe the channel. Also like the videos and keep coming for new sessions and I'll, you will see my face and do spread the love. Do let your uh, friends also know uh, to your siblings and your cousins, whoever is there that we are, we have started with the new channel Vedantu Young Wonders. Come and show some love. All right. Bye bye guys. Good evening once again. Thank you.